What's going on, everyone? I don't have sunglasses on. They're prescription. So I don't think I'm walking around my house with sunglasses on. Uh, what's going on, everyone? Earlier we talked about the importance of uh, establishing a residence with rooms for your children when you get um, divorced. And you have to... Uh, you're asked to leave or you have to move out. Um, I think it's important too uh, during this this uh, new beginning is to take advantage of uh, the time that you don't have your children. Do not you know get stuck in a rut. And watch TV all day, play video games, listen to music all day. You know, this is your time to you know make something happen. And for me, you know, uh, I've gotten a lot of help from family members and friends throughout my life. But something new I'm doing. Every day, I try to remind myself, well, I pretend. I try to pretend that I have no family. And that it's just me with my children and what I would do to support them. And when you, when you go deep into that, it's scary when you think about it. You know, imagine people who have no help. And have to, you know, raise children. And they're the sole provider. You know. Um, but you also don't want to get caught up with always asking people for help. You know, you're going to have to figure this out on your own. Uh, with the help of other people. Um, So, you know, I'm trying to do a lot of things, stay active, stay busy. Um, you know, it's difficult when you have a close relationship with your children. And then other people want to, you know, disrupt that. I think a lot of problem with guys, too, is they, they're passive and they settle. They let the courts decide and other people decide. It's almost like the default choice. But you have to continue to fight um, for your children, especially when the children want to be with you. That's the most difficult part. And a lot of women know that. A lot of mothers know that. A lot of women can be spiteful. Because they know how much you want to be with the children. So they'll do it just on purpose. So don't let that get to you either. You know, just, just have a plan. A plan's important for anything you do. You know, when you have a, when you have a plan, you build some confidence. And when you have a plan... And you stick to it. And you grind every day. There's nothing anybody can say to knock you off your uh, your path. Because you know that there's a plan. There a lot of times when people ask me if I had a plan, and I didn't. And you know it. You know that you don't have a plan. Because when they ask you, you don't know how to respond. But when you have a plan, when someone says that to you, when someone asks you, you're very quick to respond. Alright. I'll, uh, I'll post another video soon. Alright, have a good night. Alright, bye.